So here we are at the Gavaroche uh, for our annual spring lunch. Um, and we're playing to a full house today. 100 covers, um, which is always pleasing. Um, we've got a very exciting spring menu devised by Michel Roux. Sadly, he can't be with us today because he's filming. But um, we've got quite a lot of the party faithful coming on, haven't we, Tom? Yeah, yeah, a good, uh, a good turnout, a few, a few old friends and new faces, and um, yeah, it should be a really enjoyable day as ever. So I'm here with uh, Silvano Giraldin, who's the director of the Gavaroche, and David Galetti, the chef sommelier. And I just want to have a quick chat about our menu today. So we're starting off with a Sampore Musso Brut as yes. an aperitif. Fantastic. I mean, such a great alternative. If you don't have a champagne, you can have such a beautiful marsan, quite crisp, lovely peachy aromas, beautiful mousse as well. And with a canapé, it's really simply fantastic. I mean, everybody knows champagne, but the Sampore is it's something which is very well thought after, very well made and it's very good to serve. And then with our starter of salmon from the VAR, we're having a Cassis Blanc, which is from Provence. Provence, such a great region there. Um, very close to Bandol, between Bandol and Marseille. Um, beautiful. I mean, you need something crisp with this dish. It's quite floral as well, just a great complexity. Uh, we'd match the dish, I think. Because the, sa well. the salmon is, uh, is not smoked. The salmon is delicately cooked. Is almost raw, so we combine with that wine very, very well. Great, and we're firing that, and I'm looking forward to this with a rose sancerre, which we're doing with a, a shrimp and wild mushroom gratin. And uh, we haven't had a very good start to spring, but it's about time I think oh, we'd have a rose. Such an explosion of berries, I mean, red raspberries, strawberry, you know, lovely Pinot Noir. Uh, and and you've got a very good creamy sauce with that, which will marry it very well. And then with our, with our main course, and I'm looking forward to this, we've got two, it's really nice to be showing two red wines with a bit of bottle age. <laughs> and the first is a Vaccara from Pascal Ferrer in the 2003 vintage. And the second, and this hasn't helped the budget at all today, <laughs> is uh, the Domaine de Trevenant in the 2001 vintage. So David, give us a little so bit well, of... So Vaccara, so in 2003, that was how we call it, a solo vintage. It's very warm, beautiful, rich berries, touch of quite spiciness and peppery notes. That would definitely, this big wine, definitely. And the Trevelon? Trevelon, just give you a smile because I think it's the sherry on top of the cake. It's, uh, well, we got the uh, Cabernet and Shiraz blend. Uh, Durbac doing such a, he is the star of the, of the area there in Port Provence. It starts to be such quite delicate in the same time, quite leathery, earthy. Um, He's to the, the start of today menu. <laughs> yeah, I think it is. It. It's, it's going to take some living up to. And then to finish things off, we're showing a lovely spring like fresh, sweet Chenin Blanc from the Loire, which is a Cote de Leon from Chateau de Thomas in the 2010 vintage. Yeah, so I mean, go with the coconut, something quite beautiful. It's, it it's fairly sweet, got a lovely apple honey. But it's not too heavy, is it? It's no, quite it's not fresh and it's nice acidity. Got a lovely, lovely freshness as well, so that should complement it fantastically. Well, we do a kind of what you would call panna cotta, yes. with that, which is superb. I mean, now we call it creme de cacao, which is a different, but it's a real panna cotta, which is very delicate, and with that fragrance, we'll marry it very well. Well, thank you both very much. I know we've got a hundred guests arriving very shortly, so uh, we need to press on. But thank you very much. Ready to rumble? Ready to rumble. <laughs> it's the lull before the storm, <laughs> David. Like yeah. it. Oh.